Welcome back, everybody. Thank you for joining me here today so that we can discuss Dr. X. So in Dr. X, we've just stumbled upon a murder. This person was killed with like unbelievable precision, like surgical precision. And that's what cues off the police that this is not just an ordinary murder, but it's actually the next murder in a string of murders that follow the same pattern. Uh, bodies are turning up that people have been killed and then in like with a scalpel and like these super precise expert ways. And also, every one of these victims is dying during a full moon. So the police are pretty sure that this one is connected to this series of killings by someone that they're calling the Moon Killer. Not the best nickname, but whatever. So they go to meet with Lionel Atwill, who runs the local kind of like medical academy. He wants to keep this story quiet so that people don't lose faith in the medical profession. So he's going to do an internal investigation alongside the police, and that's the story here. So, I like this movie. I thought it was really solid. It's only 76 minutes, so it's pretty brisk. This has kind of like old school universal horror vibes, which I love. I love the visuals here. It's two-strip Technicolor. Faye Ray in two-strip Technicolor. How amazing is that? Lionel Atwill is great as always, so the performances are good. The visuals are good. Like, the, the old school atmosphere here is really good. It's really... It's got some tension, and it's got some, like, spookiness, and it's also just got, like, some mad scientist vibes with all the different medical equipment and whatnot. Uh, the only issue that I kind of have here is that I wish it would have been, like, maybe a little more horror-oriented, but it's still a really solid murder mystery with some light horror elements involved. And again, it captures that kind of, a little bit of that essence of the old-school universal horror, so that's, you know, that's pretty good. That's my review for Dr. X. I thought it was really solid. I enjoyed it. Definitely looking forward to the sequel. If you want to hear more of my reviews, you can go right here on YouTube to my movie review playlist or check out my website, markfusion.com, for thousands of reviews. But thank you for watching this one. I do greatly appreciate it, and hopefully I'll see you soon.